Dylan Thompson, Chase Motorsports, Coach and Trailer Sales, Paducah, Kentucky. Folks, we've got a star of the show on our hands today. I've got a 2018 Renegade Icon, 22,000 miles. Just rode over 22,000 miles, and it is a show stopper, guys. As you can see, full body paint. It's got the 600 horsepower Freightliner Cascadia chassis, and... Um, Lots to show you on this one. The Icon line, uh, which is the top shelf, top tier line that uh, Renegade produces. Um, they don't very, make very many. I've heard around 100 or 120 total of these guys were produced. I have no verification, but that's what I've heard from a few different sources at Renegade. So again, 2018 Renegade Icon. It's a quad slide, bath and a half. Uh, it's got your dual inverters, 12.5 own-end generator with, I believe, under 600 hours, maybe 580 hours. Um, holds 150 gallons of fuel. I believe it's got a 70 on the uh, passenger side and an 80 on the driver's side. Full body paint. And check that out. When they paint an icon, they actually paint even the edges of the slide. So when you roll the slide out, it all looks uh, symmetrical. Very, very, very nice, folks. Um, Cummins engines got the ISX 15 under the hood with the six speed Allison. And the Allison's the uh, 4000 series, so got the big boy Allison under the hood. Um, something else I like about the Icon that I'll point out is the uh, what they call like a stainless appearance package. So eight or 10 inches down there on the bottom runs full length of the body of the coach, and that is uh, what they call the stainless appearance package. I like that. I really like it. Just gives it that top tier look that we're looking for in the icon. Tandem axle um, does have the differential lock, and this coach has uh, brand new drive tires on it, and the steers were replaced earlier this year. So you can say all the tires were replaced within the last year. The steers maybe have a couple thousand miles, and the uh, drives are brand new. Um, one more thing on the Icon that's a little different. Let me kind of zoom out where you can get a full view here. The rear fiberglass cap. You can see all of the little uh, bullet-style marker lights that go up the edges across the top. And then you've got lots of brake and marker turn signals. Love it. I love the rear cap on the Icons. Back up where you can get a good look at it here. It's got the big Zip-D awning uh, that uh, runs full length, probably 32, 33 foot long, runs the whole body of the coach there. 40,000 pound hitch. Um, we've got the uh, the connector on the back for a Voyager cam. So if you got a camera on your trailer, no problem. You can plug in, it's already pre-wired for all that. Uh, we've got glad hand fittings for air ride and air brakes. If you got that on your trailer, so all that's uh, pre-made and on the coach and, and ready to go. Um, we uh, we do have outdoor entertainment already on this one. As you can see there, it's got a Samsung TV with a Bose soundbar. So that's something else in the Icon line that you'll notice. Uh, they use Samsung TVs and Bose soundbars. Again, the Icon is the flagship model of Renegade, and everything is just kind of next level in it. So, you know, instead of using a Samsung TV and a Samsung soundbar, uh, you have a Samsung TV and a Bose soundbar. So, again... Just trying to take it to the next level there. Uh, what I was mentioning earlier is this coach has the outdoor entertainment, uh, as you can see there, but we also carry the outdoor uh, fridge slash freezer combos in stock with the sliding trays. So if that's something that you were interested in, no problem at all. We can hook you right up. Lots of storage on the Icon. Um, it does have a uh, full hydraulic automatic leveling. Uh, by HWH, it's got the automatic, or excuse me, the hydraulic slide outs, uh, which are all flush mounts. So when the coach uh, is completely closed up, as you can uh, see in some of the pictures we've put online, the outside is smooth. There's no uh, framing of any of the slide that sticks out whatsoever. Uh, this coach does have Aqua Hot, so it's got the hydronic heating. Uh, basically, how Aqua Hot works, it either takes diesel. Uh, and runs it through a little, uh, kind of like a little torpedo heater type deal, heat exchanger, and makes hot uh, antifreeze. And the antifreeze runs through uh, like a little radiator heat exchanger type deal, uh, mixes with your water. It doesn't ever touch, but it gets real close to it and creates hot water. Um, 
And then the Aqua Hot also makes heat. So you can take electricity from your generator or if you're plugged into shore power um, and heat up these electrodes and again makes hot water um, or it makes um, hot antifreeze that air blows over and creates heat. So lots of options. This one has the Aqua Hot 600 series. So that's something you would see on you know, a higher end class A, let's say, you know, I'm not, I'm just naming these as, as uh, high end class A's, but maybe a marathon or a Newell, um, you know, companies like that are gonna use the equivalent of the 600 Aqua Hot. So um, quite a few storages on this side. Again, one of them, um, this one over here, uh, the first, the closest one to the steps, you could um, easily put the sliding cooler slash freezer in. So let's take you on a little walk through the interior. take my shoes off. We just clean this one, so I don't want to get the floor dirty in it. And how about the Chase Motorsports doormat? Complimentary. You buy a doormat, and we give you the coach, right? Just kidding. All right, so um, heated floors. Um, we'll start up here in the cab, and then we'll work our way through the back. So um, this is a full, uh, like an aero cab, walk-through cab. Let me zoom out here where you can see. So I'm uh, walking up and I can literally walk into the cab, take a seat uh, without having to duck down or squat down. Uh, the seats are both air ride and they um, both have heat and massage on them. That's right, heated and massage seats. Again, 600 horse Cummins. Uh, we've got our six speed Allison in dash navigation. Um, it's got um, stereo, Bluetooth, all that. Uh, all your controls there, your cruise control, and uh, your engine brake and everything's also controlled from like Smart Wheel, uh, which is on the steering wheel. Uh, spin around here, so we'll start on, we'll start a little different this time, we'll start on the passenger side. So right there you've got probably a 55, 60 inch love seat uh, that does turn into like a little jackknife bed, so um, someone shorter or a little kid or, or someone going with you, they could easily... Uh, fold that dude out and sleep there. Uh, up above, you've got a Bose um, surround sound system, DVD player. Uh, it is pre-wired with satellites. You've got direct TV, as you can see in that one. A little Bose soundbar overhead, Samsung TV, and that TV uh, will sink down into that cabinet. So while you're driving, if you need to look over your right shoulder and look out that window, the TV, um, while you're driving, you can lower it down into the cabinet. In the uh, kitchen area, we've got a um, Samsung convection microwave, two burner induction cooktop. We've got one of the Fisher Paykel dish drawers, dishwasher, and all granite too, guys. And this is real. This is not lookalike stuff. This is the real deal. Tiled backsplash, uh, the big single basin uh, sink. And uh, then we'll spin around this way. Over here, we've got a sofa that has a queen-size hide bed and air mattress. And what about the little ottoman uh, made by Villa, the same company that makes the furniture for the RV. And uh, heated floors, I mean, you can see, I mean, look at that, the big tiles, too. Love the flooring that they put in a lot of these. So we got the sofa, turns into a bed. Uh, Booth-style dinette does not turn into a bed. However, if you needed that extra sleeping, um, I've said in some of our other videos, we do have the um, the equipment and the uh, parts and tools in stock to convert that to a bed, so let us know. Something I wanna note, and I showed this on, we uh, recently advertised a 2023 Icon, the windows. The windows are one of the things in an Icon that stands out the most to me. It's like having a, a newer home with big uh, picture windows, maybe in the uh, living room or kitchen or something. They just really, really, really um, get the job done. A lot of, just feels open. I don't know. It's hard to explain maybe without being here, but uh, residential fridge, got the pull-out freezer, uh, French door, Samsung with ice and um, fresh water there in the door. Move on back. We're still on the driver's side. We've got some cabinetry, little pantry area with, um, check this out. Yeah. Now, how cool is that? Put your stuff in for your, you know, close to your kitchen there. And then um, as we move on back, you've got the little louver doors there. It's a washer and dryer. Washers on the bottom, dryers on the top. 
Splendid brand, uh, great products. See them in a lot of RVs. And we're going to turn back around. Of course, there's where we came in. That's our entry area. Oh, let's speak of this. So this coach has Icon uh, uses a completely different control system than like the standard Classic and XL model. But you can control lighting, shades, stuff in the main, you know, living area here, the bedroom, the bathroom, the outside. It's so cool. They even have theater mode. So I thought this was cool. Theater mode drops the night shades down, which makes it really dark and raises the TV up. How freaking cool is that? All right, so on back, um, we've got a half bath, real simple, a uh, little vanity, sink, overhead, um, medicine cabinet, and then um, both toilets in here are the Tecmas, which is like a electric flush. Very nice, very neat, easy to operate. And then um, step into the bedroom here. We've got like a sliding entertainment slash uh, wardrobe area. Got some nice cabinetry, some uh, racks to hang clothing. See there? Even the inside of the cabinets are stained. How about that? Same color as the outside. I like it. Um, and then uh, over here, king size bed. And this is a sleep number bed. So you set your sleep number and he airs up to whatever... Sleep number, if you want something softer or something more firm, uh, just press your number there and they'll get it done. Uh, back here in the master bath, again, we've got another Tecma electric flush toilet. Um, day and night shade there on the emergency, and that is an emergency exit window. Uh, in case of uh, any a fire or hazard or something, you can pop those two little red clips and bail right on out. And then the star of the show. The shower is always one of the coolest things that I've seen in a coach. Um, you've got, look at that, overhead rains on you, even sprays here on the front, little teak seat you can fold down off the wall there to set. So I uh, love the shower, all tile and little skylight overhead there. So we'll spin around where you can see a uh, little vanity sink area, nice, neat, clean. I know I say that a lot, but in an icon, that's their goal. They're just taking years of knowledge, uh, years of building coaches at Renegade and uh, putting it all in, giving it everything they had on this model. Uh, again, you've got the same coach control here in the bedroom, as you can see the screen up there. So you can control the coach from either place. And then you also have little wall areas. I mean, there, you don't have to be at one of those screens to you know, turn a light on. Uh, there's panels throughout the coach. You can see one up here between the two windows that would control like your dinette lighting, um, lighting over the couch and stuff like that. But um, give us a shout if I can help you. My cell phone number uh, is there on the screen. And uh, we buy, we sell, we trade, we even do some consignments. So uh, we'd love to earn your business. And we also deliver nationwide and we uh, have some pretty good financing options too. So Give us a shout. Um, subscribe to our channel. We'll put the little button up there on the screen for you. Would love to have you a part of uh, showing you what we're doing out here and and uh, what we have for sale. But Dylan Thompson, Chase Motorsports Coach and Trailer Sales. I really appreciate you tuning in and um, look forward to hearing from you. So thanks for watching. Have a good one.